Okay, so the dance is going to start off with just me and mom. It's about four beats of music. Both of our hands are on our right hip, and we're just going to jump from side to side. Each time, if you go to the right side, you're going to be on the balls of your feet on the opposite foot. So you're going to start jumping to the right, left, right, left. And when I say jump, it's a very small, more like step and tap, okay? And you're kind of shaking your hip a little bit with it. So it's one, two, three, four. Then the line starts off that is sapno ka sansar. So you're gonna put both your hands by your ear like you're dreaming. You're gonna put your left leg out. So it goes that is sapno ka. And then for sansar, you're gonna bring your left leg in. Do flower hands, start at the chest. And you're gonna go out like you're doing the world, okay? The next line is the verne vala hai. So you're gonna put your right hand out like you're saying stop, and then your left hand. And during this, you're just shaking your right hip. So it goes tere sapno, shake your left hip. Kasansar, savarne, right hip, vala hai, still right hip. And then it goes sunahe, so you're gonna put your right hand on your waist your left hand by your ear, and you're gonna put your right leg out. So it goes sunahe, and then it goes asamase, so you're gonna take two steps diagonally to the left. You're, with your left hand, you're gonna point. Okay, so you're, again, start at the chest, go down, and then up towards the sky. So one, two, and then from here, again, flower hands, you're gonna step diagonally back to your spot and pretend like you're bringing something down with you from the sky. So that whole sequence goes Tere sapno ka sansar savarne vala hai sunahe asma se chand utarne vala hai. Okay, and I'm on the balls of my right foot and I'm stepping back with my left foot. So the next line is six beats. The first line, you're going to take your flower hands and go out. Then you're going to go on the balls of your right foot and step with your left foot. Take the flower hands like you're flicking something. Start at the top and work your way down for five beats. So one, two, three, four, five. Then you're going to Put your right hand over your left hand around the abdomen area. Swing side to side like you're holding a baby. Again, same step. You're on the balls of your right foot and you're just stepping with your left foot and you swing side to side. So it goes up good, maybe. It's talking about the good and then it goes bichai rakhna, bichai rakhna. So three beats, you're swinging and then three beats, just like you were flicking from the top here, you're gonna flick out. So one, two, three. Then the next line is Ignana Sameman Ane Valahe. So you're gonna start by jumping towards the right. Your right hand goes on the bottom by your waist area. Your left hand goes on over it, but face down around the bust area. So it's almost like you're referring to the size of a baby. So it goes one, and then you're gonna flip it as you jump to the left, two. And then for Ane Valahe, you're gonna do come here diagonally to your left and again you're just stepping with this the line repeats itself so again to the right to the left and this time you're going to do come here from the right and again just stepping with it next is music and this is when everyone's going to enter it's about five ish beats so the first one you're going to jump to the right jump to the left jump to the right jump to the left. If you're coming on, just kind of jump to whatever direction you need to to get on. You have about four beats. It's a little slow, so listen to the music. The last beat, time right hand down, left hand up. As you spin halfway, your right hand's gonna come up, left hand down, and as you finish your spin, your right hand will also come down. Then it goes, it talks about the gold again, so you're gonna do the swinging step for three beats. And again, you're just stepping with it. And then it goes, then for three beats, you, for, sorry, for four beats, you pretend like you're eating something. And this time you're just shaking your right hip. You're facing kind of diagonally to the right. So it goes one, start feeding yourself with your right hand and your left hand is just face down like you're about to pick something up. So it goes one, two, three, four. 
Then again, you have the god line, so you're just stepping with it and swinging your hands. And then from there, you're going to put your left foot out, flower hands up to the top, your left hand, sorry, your right hand is higher than your left hand. Then you're going to go out like you're saying stop, flower hands, stop. And you're just shaking your left hip with this beat. So it goes one, two, three, four, and then there's music. So again, this time right hand down, left hand up. As you spin halfway, your right hand's gonna come up, left hand down, and as you finish your spin, your right hand will also come down. Then from there goes hogi teri chavi. So you're gonna start, again, you're doing stop sign with your hands, so your right hand comes out, left hand is covering half of your face, you switch three times, you switch twice, so you do the step three times. So it goes one, two, three, and again the footwork is just stepping with it. For four beats, you're going to put your right hand in a fist, your left hand straight out, you're going to put your left hand around your abdomen area, your elbow goes where your fingers are, and you're going to put your chin on your right fist, you're going to jump to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. Miremunna kesa hoga vo. And then it goes vyakul he. So for vyakul, you're going to do like spirit fingers, except you're just going to shake. For vyakul he, you're going to put your hands out like a five, put them around your neck, and just shake side to side. And then with your legs, you're going to make a small little circle. So just take your finger. And go, so it goes vyakul he nena, nena mema kesa hoga vo. So Again, flower hands like you're doing Y and you're just stepping with it. So it goes one, two, three, four. It was kind of like when we were eating, one hand face up, the other hand face down, and you're just doing Y. Then again, after that line is the spin. So right hand down, left hand up. You're going to cross with your left foot. It's a slow spin. As you flip halfway, your right hand will come up, left hand down. And then when you finish the spin, the right hand will come down as well. Then from there, you're going to do angan is one beat. So you're going to put your right foot out, flower hands like you're showing your garden, and from there you're going to bring your hands together down by your left leg, and then up towards at your face level like you're holding a dio. So it's a very fast like one, and then two is the dio, and then for four beats like you're throwing something, you're going to start at the dio and then go over your head back to the right, and you're just shaking your hip with it. So one, two, three, four. And then it goes Neikadmose. So pick up your sari, your cholier a little bit so that they can see your feet. You're gonna jump to the right, jump to the left, and then this one you're just stepping with it, and with your hands you're like imitating your feet. So it goes Nekadmoka, and you're just imitating that for four beats. Chum chum karne nekadmo ka chum chum karne wala hai. Then again is the chorus like nana sameman. So again, your right hand is by your abdomen, face up. Your left hand is by the bust area, face down. You're gonna jump to the right. When you jump to the left, you flip your hands. You're gonna start doing the come here with from the diagonal left. So it goes one, two, one, two, three, four, and then again one, two, and then this time from the right one, two three, four. This next music is also a little awkward, but you're just going to put both hands on your right hip. You're not jumping side to side. You're just going to shake your hip with the music. It's about four beats. Then the line starts Radha Krishna. So for, for the first two beats, you're going to start with your hands out to the left and bring the flute around from the left to the right. So you can see my hand, my right hand is out, my left hand is closer to um, my face, and my fingers on the left are facing back, my fingers on the right are facing forward. From there, you're going to cross your left foot in front, kind of bend a little bit so that you're leaning down, and you're going to spin around. Then from there, it talks about your god again, so for three beats you're going to swing side to side while stepping. And then it talks about the gar, so you're going to put like a roof over your head, jump to the right, 
for two beats, jump to the left for two beats. Again, you're gonna do that slow spin. So your right hand starts off down, left hand up, cross with your right leg. As you spin halfway, your hand switch, and then as you complete the spin, the right hand comes down as well. Then it talks about like the bia being gora, so you're gonna take both hands and kind of like make small little circles around your cheeks as you're stepping with it. So it goes one, two, three, and then kind of like you're doing the vaha va step. Again, you're just shaking your right hip. You're gonna go one, two, three, and then kind of just move my head side to side for the last beat or two. So it goes one, two, three, four, five. Then it goes, it's talking about the feet again. So you're gonna lift your sari or trolley up, jump to the right, jump to the left. And then kind of like when we did the munna step, your left hand comes out straight. Your right hand goes on top of your left hand. Your right leg goes out and kind of like you're tapping your chin and you're just gonna shake your hips to it, okay? for four beats, one, two, three, four. After that, again, comes the spin. You know the drill, right hand down, left hand up, and then when you finish, both hands are down. After that, it's kind of like you're skipping, but not really. So you're gonna cross your right foot and do right flower hands, kind of like you're showing off, and your left hand is behind your back. So it goes one, two, and then as if you're as if words are coming out of your mouth you're going to do like a peace sign and kind of like revolve them around each other by your lips area facing diagonal facing to the right um the next step again talks about the gold so you do the swinging step for three beats and then the flower step like you're throwing it from the top and then the chorus comes again this time it's three times so you do one to the right, to the left, come here from the left, repeat right, left, come here from the right, right, left, come here from the left, and then it goes, you have like four sharp beats. So my right, my, sorry, my left foot goes out. I do flower hands up top where they're crossing. I bring my hands out for the second beat, like I'm saying stop. For the third beat, I bring my flower hands inside by my bust area, again crossing, facing up. So up here they were like this, down here like this, and then the last beat you can do whatever pose you want. So you can go out, this, anything you want. And that's the end of the dance.